Hi everyone, meteorologist Taylor Canoost with your forecast. Of course, uh, all eyes nationally are on Hurricane Ian, but uh, we are keeping an eye on some chilly weather here in central Iowa tonight, and we may see our first frost of the season in a good portion of the state. Frost advisory has been posted for most of Iowa from midnight tonight until 8 o'clock in the morning on Wednesday. Now, not all of our lows will be below freezing, but even when you see those lows in the mid 30s, you can at least get some patchy frost to develop, and we are expecting that uh, since we'll have a clear and calm night tonight. But up north, you might get temperatures to dip down to or even just below the freezing mark. Forecast low of 31 tonight in Clarion and 31 in Pocahontas. Once you get to central Iowa, those temperatures likely will stay just above the freezing mark. Forecast low in Des Moines is 37, down to 33 in Ames and also 33 in Jefferson. More of that, those type of temperatures expected for southern Iowa tonight. 34 in Centerville and 36 overnight tonight in Creston. So uh, certainly our chilliest night of the fall season coming our way. And with those temperatures getting close to the freezing mark, a, a good reminder to cover up or bring inside those plants that are a little sensitive to those cooler temperatures. That might include the pumpkins as well. Make sure to drain those uh, water lines and disconnect the hoses from the faucets outside. Uh, you know, we might not get to the freezing point in Des Moines where that's technically an issue, but might be a good idea to do that just in case. And have the scraper ready to go tomorrow morning. There might be a little frost on those windshields, but it won't take long to get rid of that as sunshine returns during the day on Wednesday. Temperatures climb back to the low and mid 60s tomorrow afternoon. 64 for your high in Des Moines on Wednesday, just a high of 63 in Ottumwa. We're starting to see those uh, temperatures rebound later this week, getting to the upper 60s for most of us by Thursday, low 70s in the forecast by Friday afternoon. Really very comfortable and fall like for the rest of this week. Surface high pressure moving out of Canada is going to plant itself over the Midwest these next few days, keeping the weather very quiet, just like we've seen so far this week. The second half of the week not looking too different, which means basically no shot at rain for the rest of this week. Weekend looks dry as well. Our next even remote possibility of any rain is next Tuesday, and even then it's a pretty long shot at this point. Here's your whole plumbing and heating 10 day forecast. Temperatures forecast to stay in the mid 70s for your highs all the way through next week. Overnight lows improve a little bit to the upper 40s and the low 50s.